Okta and the Love of Roaches. Ever since I was a teenager, I had very intense fantasies about having sex with a giant roach. It started in 9th or 10th grade when we read The Metamorphosis by Franz Kafka. As I started to think more and more about the roach creature that the creature had, the character had become, I started to imagine what it would be like if a woman turned into the roach instead. I found this idea very arousing. I would not be repulsed or frightened of her, as the characters in the story are. I would take care of her. Then my thoughts started to get sexual with the character. Eventually, I sort of dropped a bit about her having been a human woman at first, and I kind of imagined this fictionalized roach species. They are giant roaches, the size of a person, and have complete intelligence. I kind of over time conjured up an imaginary friend of sorts. She was one of these roaches and her name was Okta. I would fantasize about her often. Whenever I masturbated, I'd be imagining elaborate scenarios of me and Okta making love. When I started to have actual sex, I found I could not uh perform. If I wasn't thinking of Okta. So basically, now every time I have I have sex with a woman. I am pretending that she is actually Okta. Not just think about Okta. I concentrate intently to visualize that I'm actually doing Okta. I don't think about the girl at all. There is only Okta. Of course, the sex can never be as fully exciting as my fully imaginary sessions with Okta. The, there are things that her multiple appendages and antenna allow for that a human woman can never match. So anyways... I've been in a relationship with my girlfriend for about a year. Three or four times I've tried to have sex with her and not pretend she's Okta, but I just can't do it. So essentially, every time we have sex, I'm imagining she is Okta. I finally confided to her this to her the other day, and I was blown away by her reaction. I thought she might take it a bit badly at first, but that she get used to it. No, I never seen such a look of disgust before. Outrage is not an understatement. She is not even returning my text now. I'm afraid she's actually going to break up with me, and also that it's going to tell people about Okta. I don't know how I will face anyone. This is going to sound silly, but I also feel guilty about feeling shame, as if Okta will be saddened by this, even though I know that she is imaginary. I just don't know what to do at this point. If you're fucking arthropods, my dude. <laughs>